Multimarine Services Limited successfully completed the air booster refurbishment project for the Weatherford Pipeline and Specialty Services. The project required the complete modification of 28 air booster units. Each unit required the removal of all existing equipment, fitting of a new bottom plate, modifications to the cooling system, fabrication of a new fan support, new fuel and oil tanks, fabrication of new battery and power boxes, fabrication of a new engine skid, relocation of the three scrubbers, fabrication of pipe supports and most importantly the fabrication of 19 pipe spools. The operating pressure of each booster is 400 bars. The project therefore required the adherence to strict codes and standards such as the ASME IX code. Throughout the fabrication process, Multimarine followed a strict quality inspection plan, which ensured full material and welding traceability. The notified body was Bureau Veritas, who certified and approved the welding procedures implemented and all the welders involved in the project. Gas Tungsten Arc Welding, or TIG Welding, was the welding method used for the fabrication of each spool. All 19 spools for each unit contained 179 welds. Each completed weld had to undergo a thorough non-destructing examination process, which included visual inspection, MPI and phased array examinations. In addition, all spools were further tested with pressure testing. A notable achievement of this project is that Multimarine's welding team successfully completed all 28 units with more than 5,000 welds without a single failure. Pipe welding is an area in which Multimarine is well experienced and accredited. The company maintains a certified quality assurance system and holds pipe welding approvals from three classification societies DNV, BV and GL. What's more, at Multimarine, we're confident that the capabilities and experience of our personnel will enable us to successfully undertake and complete more pipe welding projects in Cyprus in the years to come.